Hi everyone. In today's tutorial, I'm going to demonstrate how to use Madrix to program effects using the controller H807SA controller. Without further ado, let me dive into my Madrix software and program the effects using the Madrix software. You need to follow the steps to use Madrix software online. This is my Madrix software. So on the Madrix software, first you need to go on preference. You click on preference here. Then you go on device manager. On this section on device manager is to, to connect the controller to the ethernet. So you come here on Artnet, click on Artnet. On Artnet, you need to click in, on this square, which written enable to enable. So you can search, then after that, you click search. So now it's read my controller. This is my controller name, which is H807SA. Then you click on DMX devices to turn on the controller. So the controller will be connected on the matrix software. And here you mark everything and you press apply, then okay. The next step now is to do the mapping. So to do the mapping, you go back to preference you click preference you can use two different options to do the mapping you can use the matrix generator or the patch editor i'm going to use the matrix matrix generator which is a faster way to do the mapping on matrix setting that's where you choose the parameters or that's where you do the mapping so here you, you leave it a dmx you leave it a dmx because we're working with dmx we're not working with the dvi you leave it a dmx and here you don't need to change anything. You can leave it at RGB. Then here rotation, you can leave it at any, you can choose any preferable rotation here. The pixel, so this is the pixel you need to change. So there's X, Y, Z, the first one is the length. So you can choose the length according to the number of pixels you have on your setup. So here, let me put 600 and here you put the, here the width let me put i'm going to work with only one list strip but let me just put five here then after that you fill all your parameters okay then you press apply after apply then you press okay this is my mapping so you can see i zoom my mapping so this is the mapping i created now the next step is to go and choose the effects and you see my list strip put in on so now we're done let's go and choose the effects to choose the effects, you come here on SCE color to choose different kind of effects. These are pre-installed effects. So you come here and you choose the first option. So choose the first option. You have different kind of effects here on this first option. Let me go with the first, this the color changing effect. So you're going to see my list strip is going to start doing the color changing effect, start rotating different colors, which is the color changing effects. So you can see my list strip is rotating, changing different color effects. You can see on my Magic software also. Let me choose the other effect. These are pre-installed effects. Let me choose the other effect. Let me go to the radio wave, the last option here. You see the difference on my list strip. So you can see this is the radio wave effect. The radio wave effects, you can see. So you can also just adjust here. Where you want this to move, you can rotate faster or can adjust here as well. It's really easy to use Madrix software online. So that's all about using Madrix software with the controller H807SA. Thank you for your time. See you on the next tutorial video.